What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm going to be giving you guys my new small guard. You know what I'm saying? I always want to make a stage, comp, pro am type of point guard. You know, something that can do everything on offense. You know what I'm saying? Sit corner on defense because, you know, these stage guards do not be playing any type of defense. So, this is my stage, comp, pro am guard right here. As you can see from the gameplay, man, we was going crazy, bro. I have never played guard in my life, but best believe I made one of the best all around point guards in the game. You know, I asked a lot of 2k league players to give me advice on this build. I made this build three times, deleted two of them, and this is the final result. So I put a lot of research and time into this build. It's literally perfect. Like this is the perfect build for a comp pro am stage. Like this is a comp threes and 5v5 build right here. Like you're gonna have a lot of fun if you make this build. But before we get into the point guard build, make sure you subscribe if you're new to the channel and turn on that noti bell so you never miss a stream or a video. And if you're one of the first people to come in noti gain or noti squad, I will be putting a name on the screen just like these beautiful people right here. Huge shout out to Coaster Army. And without further ado, let's get straight into this Debbie God stage guard. Let's get it. Like and subscribe in the next five seconds so you'll never hit a jump shot again. I would not risk it. Now I'm going to be showing gameplay throughout the video so when we talk about each attribute I'll show some gameplay so don't worry about that but it's going to be a point guard 6'2", 190 pounds. Now the wind spin is going to be 6'7", you don't got to change this, you don't got to put it up or down but this is the physicals for the build. Now starting off with the finishing, you're going to have an 88 driving dunk so you get really good dunk packages on this build. You also get pro contact dunks. Now, in order to get pro contact dunks, we do need a 75 vertical. So we're gonna move this up to a 75. So we get silver posterizer and gold aerial wizard. Now, not only are we gonna have an 88 driving dunk, but we're also gonna have a 75 driving layup, just so we can hit layups and dunk the ball. We're also gonna have a 45 standing dunk, so we get some pretty solid standing dunk animations. So you could drive to the rim, you get contact dunks, you get very solid dunk packages. You also get standing dunks, so we're already pretty solid with the finishing. Alright, now let's talk about the shooting. We have a 93 three-pointer. This should be more than enough to get the best jump shots in the game. As far as the badges, you get silver agent three. Gold Blinders, Gold Deadeye, Silver Limitless Range, Gold Catch and Shoot, Gold Green Machine, Gold Guard Up, Gold Space Creator, Hall of Fame, Claymore, Hall of Fame, Comeback Kid, Gold Quarter Specialist, and Hall of Fame Open Looks. Like you get almost every badge, Gold or Hall of Fame, except for Agent 3 and Limitless Range. Now, I wish I could have one more three pointer for a 94 three pointer so we get gold agent three, but uh, so we're gonna stick with the 93 because we need those attributes elsewhere. Now for the free throw, we're gonna max this out to a 99 because it, it literally costs no overall at all. Like you do not waste any type of attributes to move this for, to a 99. So if you're playing cop pro am, you're playing rec, anything to do with free throws, you're gonna knock it down every single time. And the cool thing with this is if you play like random rec, you're gonna get all the transition fouls, so you're gonna get some free points. So 99 free throw is, is low key. If you're messing with a 99 free throw, I don't know what to tell you. But the shooting on this build is very, very elite. You should not be missing with this build. Now for the playmaking. Now the playmaking is the most important. You know what I'm saying? Like you need to get open on lockdowns with high steel, high perimeter. You gotta get open. So you're gonna have a 95 ball handle. This will allow you to get Hall of Fame handles for days. We just gotta upgrade the stamina real quick. Move this up to a 99. Hall of Fame handles for days. Let me just upgrade the physicals real quick. You have an 86 speed. I know it doesn't sound like a lot, but this will get you gold hyperdrive and gold speed booster. You're gonna have a 73 acceleration. And you're gonna have a 90 speed with ball. That way you get the Kyrie Irving dribble style. If you do not know, the Kyrie Irving dribble style is broken. Like I'm just speed boosting around the court. Like any move I do, I'm speed boosting. Like I'm boosting around the court. It's crazy. The Kyrie Irving dribble style is very fast, very good. I will be giving you guys my SIGs 
very soon. I'm just gonna lab up for a little bit. I don't wanna give you my sigs right away. I wanna actually work on them, make sure they're the best they could possibly be, but I'm gonna, I will be dropping my sigs very soon. So, 95 ball handle, you have gold killer combos, gold speed booster, gold unplugable, hall of fame ankle breaker, silver blow by, hall of fame handles for days. All around you get all gold and hall of fame playmaker badges or the ones that matter are gold and hall of fame. Now for the pass accuracy, passing in comp scenarios is very very important. All it takes is like a split second for a shot being open or contested so you need a high pass accuracy in a stage in pro-am 5v5 all that so we're gonna move this up to 87 that way we get bronze bailout silver dimer silver needle threader gold special delivery silver touch passer gold break starter and silver relay passer so not only do you get bailout but you get very solid pass animations with the 87 you get like very good pass packages i don't even know what it's called but you get good pass you have very good pass on this build best believe that so all around the playmaking is insane you're gonna be able to dribble pass all that so you can shoot you get contact dunks you can do standard dunks drive dunks you can do everything on offense now for the strength we're gonna move this up to a 55 just to get a little bit of strength just so you get fearless finisher on bronze and with the rest of the attributes Another reason why I want a strength is just so I don't get bullied too much. You're still going to get bullied because you're a 6'2 guard, but I just want a little bit of strength just so I can hold my own in the paint just a little bit. But now for the defense. We only have one more overall to cook with the defense. So we're going to move this up to a 64. And with the rest of our attributes, we're going to move the interior defense up to a 58. Now, some people are asking, like, why did I even bother having some interior defense? But this 58 interior defense will actually allow you to get a stop or two in the paint. Because a lot of times, you know, say people like to just go over little guards. But if you have your hands up, you will actually get a few stops here and there. Not every time you're most likely going to get bodied, but sometimes you actually do get some clutch stops. See, I got defense. <laughs> yeah, good D. I'm telling you, if they, don't, if they try to force it up without drop stepping you, you get a stop. You can low-key show that, bro. That's a good clip for the build video. Like, you might have a 60 interior, but you get stops like this. 64 perimeter defense. It's kind of pitiful, not going to lie. But you are going to be in the corner most of the time. Your job is to score every point on offense. You're going to be able to dot your teammates, shoot like crazy shots for the three-point line you're gonna be a speed boost dribble guide it, like this build is amazing i'm not gonna lie so with your final attributes it's not a lot you could put it on you could just throw it anywhere i'm just gonna put one on offensive rebound but that's gonna do it for the build i did try to throw some gameplay at the start of the video and throughout the video but as you can see you got shades of kenny smith damian lillard and tyrese maxi this is the three or this is the playmaking three level threat. You guys are gonna see a ton of gameplay moving forward on this build. Like, I'm gonna be dropping mad videos on this build. Like the best jump shot for guards, sinks, comp pro am. It's gonna get crazy, but that's gonna do it for today's video. Hope you guys have a blessed day and peace.